Okay, adding a border to an image or a footage is very common in many videos, today I will create my own border effect in Fusion with expressions and macros, so that I can reuse it in future projects. Here is an image in the timeline that needs a border. While it's selected, go to the Fusion page. From the toolbar, drag a background node to the node's editor. Change the background color to white. Unlink the media in and out node, drag the media in output to the background output, it will automatically add a merge node with both media in and background nodes connected. Make sure the media in is connected as foreground and background node is background. Connect the merge node to media out. Select background, go to the inspector, open the image tab. Right click the width and choose modify with expression. And the modifiers tab is now enabled. Go to the modifiers tab. Rename the modifier to border width. In the number in one field, enter the equal sign to enable the expression input. Type in the expression to get the image's original width. In the number in two field, enter 30, we use this field to define the width of the border. Go to the number out tab, enter N1 plus N2 as the number expression. N1 and N2 are the internal names used by expressions, representing the fields number in 1 and 2 respectively. Go back to the Tools tab, in the Image Height field, enter equal sign to enable expression input. Enter the expression to get the image's original height plus the border width, which is controlled by the number in 2 field of border width modifier. Switch to the Modifiers tab. We can change the number in 2 field to 60 and the border gets wider. Right-click the border width title and select Edit Controls. Find the field ID in 2. Name it Border Width. Change the page to Controls, enter Default 30, check the integer mark. Enter the range from 1 to 200, change the input control to slider control. Click OK to confirm the change. In the inspector, border width appears at the bottom with a slider control. Change the slider value to adjust the width of the border. We are now done with the expressions and edit control setting. Go to the nodes editor, select the background one and merge one nodes, right click and choose to create macro from the context menu. Give the macro a name, for example my border. Export all the fields in the color section, as we want the ability to adjust border colors. In the border width section, we need only the N2 field to define the border width, make sure the name is changed to border width. We can also set the default, minimum and maximum values here. Go to the file menu, choose save as, and save the macro to the default folder. Close the macro editor. Now go back to the edit page. Drag an image to the timeline. Enter the Fusion page. Select the Media in node and press Shift space to open the tool selection. Type in border in the search field and the newly created macro My Border is listed. Add to the node and we have a border added to the image. In the Inspector panel, we can adjust border width with the slider or we can change border type and colors. That's it, a colored border effect is created and can be reused in other projects. Wait, adding this border to an image with round corners doesn't look nice, can we include corner adjustment to the effect? Yes we can, I will show you how in the next video. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.